The STEPS program is, STEPS is an acronym for Site Training Employment Program and Services. It's a program that runs from uh, usually 10th to 12th grade, but it essentially is a program that teaches students the work skills they need, that they will need moving on beyond high school, beyond their graduation. Uh, work skills including, uh, that go beyond the job itself. So in other words, they're not just pouring the coffee, they're learning uh, how to accept feedback and how to be on time, what the hygiene and the rules are for in a work setting. Uh, we have various levels of steps. We have programs that are here in the high schools, both Freedom and Liberty, and then we have programs that take them out into the community in both competitive and non-competitive ways. So when they come in into the program in ninth or 10th grade, they are um, green, as you say, as employees, and they're learning those initial soft skills of how to make eye contact and greet people and uh, shake hands, and eventually how to be a leader within their group, within their, their peers that they're working with, which is their co-workers at that point. They're no longer just their classmates. Um, as they grow in those skills, we move them out into community-based areas, uh, usually starting in a school in the district, whether it's an elementary or a middle school, and then moving into a community uh, partner. Uh, could be one of the hotels or, or grocery stores or other businesses in the neighborhood. And the goal is for them to become independent in those skills as much as they can, uh, so that their independence gets them as much as they can uh, in their adulthood. So steps one is the beginning or the entry level of our work program. It's based here in the building and they do soft skills, they do delivery services, they do copy services, they do laminating services, they fill soda machines, they run the school store, and those are all based about around their soft skills. Steps two is a program that follows steps one. After some soft skills are gained, they go into the community um, and some of the places here at Liberty High School, the coffee shop, Freedom High School, the coffee shop, the new machines that we've purchased this year, poster maker, cutout maker, those are then work skills that we focus on. And there's probably about five or six that we really focus on following directions, working with your team, being able to take corrective criticism, showing up on time, your attendance. Steps three is uh, a program that uh, the students are fully competitively employed by the employer. The goal is for them to be 100% independent and be able to work day to day without supports. Uh, we provide the support systems uh, for job interviews, uh, resume building, uh, how to follow up on a uh, on an interview, and it allows us to focus on the abilities and strengths outside of the classroom and and prepare them for the future. The students love this program. They love building a connection uh, with their mentors out on their jobs. They love um, uh, going to work every day. Um, the residents love them at, at Country Meadows. Um, the customers at Valley F uh, Family Restaurant uh, are excited to see them and have conversations with them during their shifts. Um, so. The students um, love, love this work training program. In fact, uh, the, the program is doubling and, and that's what we like to see. This has really been a successful program for both Liberty and Freedom and the Bethlehem community. They're still in their late 20s, early 30s, still the same businesses. You know, they show up every day. They don't call off. They're productive and they would really like to be uh, pr productive members of society.